are the troublemakers? Who were they? Folks, this is the album. These are the people in question. Who are the deadly bees? What happened to the troublemakers? What's up, Tim? You getting ready for the show, yeah? I'm getting ready for the show. All right. Uh, are we expecting anything interesting? No, it's a troublemaker show. It'll be boring as usual. All right. Has anybody seen Rodney? There he is. Rodney, are you ready? Tim, what are your words for uh, the excitement tonight? Uh, hold on, I gotta pay somebody. He's gonna yell. He's gonna yell for us. I need my money. I got 13 bucks. That's good. You gotta change for a two and a five. Five. This is always the most uncomfortable part, isn't it? You gotta pay off the audience. Yeah. What are you fixing there, man? I'm just trying to reinforce my kick drum. Stay, so it stays in place. That's the goal. Hey, there's a, there's a nurse behind you. You saw that? It was Halloween. 2001, Sacramento, California, at the old Ironsides Tavern. We weren't expecting anything, but we saw four deadly bees walk in. We didn't think much until one of them happened to look like Stan Troublemaker. Now folks, we're not promising anything, but there is a chance, there is a possibility that those deadly bees that night were either ghostly apparitions of Stan, Tim, Brian, and Rodney, or they were the Troublemakers. Thank you, Sally. Citizens, the last known image we have of the Troublemakers was this here photo taken by yours truly, Flint Devious, for the cover of their album, The Great Lost Troublemakers. It was only shortly thereafter, Halloween to be exact, that the deadly bees flew in and the Troublemakers disappeared. Why? Was it extortion? Taxes? An unpaid bar tab? We really don't know, folks. What we ask is this. Who are the deadly bees? Who doesn't wear a Look carefully here, folks. We believe that the real stand is being stuffed into a burlap bag and a quasi stand is taking its place. Sally is in the lab spending countless hours studying the footage. Okay, Tim. Six hundred people out front. I'm allergic to bees. Ow! This hurts. It's tucking under your belt. I don't so. have a belt. What? Neither do I. Well, you stick it in the back of your pants. Tape down there. I think we're ready to go. Why? Why? Oh yeah, the photos, I forgot. Flint, the footage does not lie. It's my scientific conclusion that this is where the deadly bees replaced the troublemakers. Go, go. Can't get in the back door? No, we want to go in through the front door. Of course we want to go through the front door. Go, oh, Lord. Oh, Jesus. There we go. Hey, don't even talk about that. Oh,
And that was their lounge act. That was a lounge act. Stan, I saw you breaking bunches of shit, but how was it, man? Look at that. Oh, man. can't find a like that. When did that happen? I don't know. Sabaton. Yeah, it's a great song. How was it, man? Give me five on that. Five. Excellent. <laughs> it sucked as usual. Hey, you gotta Rodney, you yes. always blossom towards the end. You think? <laughs> Takes me a while to wake up. I kind of want to be able to see this embarrassment. Oh, too much goodness, and I can't carry it all on one shoulder. <laughs> I can't carry all this stuff either, but you give it all to me.